All right, y'all, welcome back to Philly D's Garage. So today I got the Honda Accord in the garage. Um, so basically today is just a follow-up on a video that I did a little while back. I cleaned the uh, battery terminals um, and I realized that my uh, fluid in the battery was low. So I got some uh, distilled water to put in there. So I wanted to show you guys that. So, but so far all I did was I took this cap off because when I pulled this up, I noticed it was a lot more uh, corrosion all up in here. So I just took this thing off because basically it's just a, ho a housing for corrosion. So this is going in the trash. Um, and I just took my wire brush, cleaned it all up, did both sides again, and I put some more uh, dielectric grease on there so that's all I did so far so um, I got the distilled water so what you want to do is if you got an older style battery like this and you, you can service it um, the water you want to use in there is distilled water so that's what this is so we're gonna open up this in a second first let me get something to pop those caps off real quick so all you need is just a screwdriver, pop bar, something like that. Pop it off. All right, so I remember last time when I was in here, I believe uh, this side was lower than this side. Let me see. Now really, I haven't been in here since I did that video, but, um, wow. Let me see something. Cause you really, you want the water to be above the plates that's in there. And let me grab another light real quick. I don't remember how low it was, but I could have sworn they were a little lower than it appears to be right now. Let me see. It took me months to go and buy some of this distilled water. And it looks like it's, oh no. So yeah, I need to add some to this one. Uh, this one looks. So a lot of these appear to be already above the plates. A little higher than I thought they were. This one looked like it's barely above it. So you want to, you don't want to fill them. You don't really want to fill them all the way up, like to the top, top. I'm not sure exactly, you know, where it's supposed to be filled, but I know it should be above the plate. So you want it to be, you know, just so you want the place to be submerged. So um, let me grab a filter real quick, and I'm gonna add up. Not a filter, a funnel that's gonna fit in one of these holes on these holes, so uh, you can add a little bit of distilled water to it. All right, y'all. So I found a funnel uh, that would fit perfectly inside these holes. So I actually already added some of the distilled water. So I added uh, some to here, this one, this one, and I believe this one. So I had a couple of them that was. Uh, low um, but if you look carefully in there you can see the plate so you'll know how to gauge it off so you just want it slightly you know above that you don't want to fill it all the way up to the port but you just want to submerge those plates in the water and another thing you might want to clean you know clean these off and clean around your battery before you take this off because you don't want to open these up and get uh, you know, like debris and stuff inside of there. So my battery was pretty clean from the last time uh, I did this. So I didn't really have to, uh, I didn't have to clean nothing up really. So, but you want to try, you don't want to get nothing inside of these ports. Um, so yeah, so once you add uh, the distilled water to it, you can uh, put these caps back on. Now, as you see, you got six uh, uh, cells, so it's a 12 volt battery, so it's two volts per um, uh, cell. So 
you want to make sure each cell is doing exactly what it's supposed to do all right so you want to put these on right tap them in now i was just driving this car this car was just running so the battery uh, was charged up already so i don't have to recharge this but you want to you want to kind of like have a good charged battery before you do this. So, all right. So you want to make sure those are all the way down, and that's it. That's that's how you add distilled water to your battery. Just make sure your your terminals is clean. Um, so doing this to keep your battery, you know, working efficiently and much longer. I would recommend like getting this checked like every. Like every oil change, like, or, I mean, if your shop won't do it that you go to, you can do it yourself. Just pop these caps off. Make sure the water level is above those plates and your battery will last as long as uh, it can. So, um, so yeah, if you enjoyed the video, like the video, share the video, comment on the video, subscribe to the channel, and I'll check you on the next one.